Everywhere here from Marty's Garden on YouTube, and today I've got a super duper video for you. How's that? Yeah, super duper because it is something that you very rarely see online, and it's about soil profiles. Now, when you're building your garden bed, do you just grab compost and your soil and just throw it all in, fill it up, and put the mulch on top? Well, if you are, that's going to work pretty good if you're adding some rock dust and fertilizers and things, you're going to get great growth. But what if you could take it one step further? What if you could assimilate? closest to nature as possible as God created to get the best possible results and still be able to go away on holidays and not have to worry about watering or freaking out if there hasn't been enough rain. So what do you need to do? Well, you need to create what they call the soil profile. So the bottom part, so you've got a two foot to one metre bed, garden bed. The bottom third is just normal soil. The middle part is actually the compost that you've broken down that you've collected. The top part, the top level, which would be anywhere from, you know, a few inches to, yeah, a few inches high, two and a half to five, ten centimetres, something like that, is the, the broken down material that's composting. It's just getting that smell where it's not smelly anymore, but it's still breaking down. And that's where all the microbes are going and all the worms are going up and feeding there. They're all going up the surface and pulling all that nutrient down. And then the plant's roots are taking it all back up again as the sunlight and photosynthesizing it. And as this plant photosynthesizes, it takes down the sugars, back down the microbes and creates this symbiotic process which is just absolutely amazing and that's what the plants like to grow and that's how they stay really healthy as well, keeping a lot of pests and diseases and problems away. Now as we're building our soil profiles, we always just keep building on top. We're throwing our mulch on top, keeping it nice and covered out of the sun, keeping it warm in winter, cool in the summer and keeping that water stored in the water bank. Now your soil profile is called a water bank. And the more water it can hold, the more roots are gonna go down deep and it's gonna perform much better. You can go away for a few days and not have to worry about watering the garden because there's plenty of soil in your soil profile water bank. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it. Hang around and watch the rest of the video because we've got some cool stuff going on outside. In spring, the soil really starts to warm up as we're getting these warmer days and the microbes and all the worms and everything start getting more active and so the plants actually start growing a lot faster and I've created these levels in the soil and uh, you know like it's really performing quite well now this is only about three weeks old it's been planted out for about two weeks and in the videos I'm going to be showing you uh, the growth of this the vertical growth beside the chicken pen and even in the next video coming up, which will be the final one for the, the backyard permaculture chicken coop, which is gonna be like a video about the whole thing and how it's all put together and as much information that I can throw in there for you guys so you can learn and possibly maybe do something similar to what I have here to save yourself time, money, and be more efficient. Oh, look, here she is. Egg. And she's got an egg. Wonderful. It's Henrietta, the black chook egg. Beautiful. All right. Listen, guys, uh, if you haven't subscribed already to Marty's Garden and you want to see more from Karen and me in the future, make sure you subscribe now and we will see you at the next video. We've got new videos coming out every week and we'd love to teach you how to grow food really fast in urban places and small spaces. Have a great day. Happy gardening and we'll see you at the next video. Say bye, Karen. Bye. Bye. We'll see you soon. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>